Nice interception. Great read. This kid can play. Wayne stole it off a very bad pass by Preston Knowles. Gary Smith trying to drive. Yaru blocked a couple. Swapshire. Air ball. This Quick race. catch and shoot. And it's Taylor King, the transfer from Duke. Knowles charge. Good defense by Dominic Cheek, the freshman from Jersey City, New Jersey. Yeah, it's interesting. They used to play at White Eagle Hall, Bobby Hurley's kids, and that's the kind of pressure you would see there. But great footwork here in position, and that's because he took away the three. Redding, a good fake out of the corner. Did not lead to an open shot. He found Pena instead. Luke Wayne's just stepping right up into that. Louisville's making one of the best teams in the country so far this year look awful here in the first half. They get it across, and Reynolds makes a three. And just what you guys have been talking about, as bad as it's been for Villanova, they're within 10 with 2.12 to go in the half and a timeout Somebody called the ball. Fisher. Oh, well done. Ooh. And a chance for a three point play. How about his strength? That is incredible. I thought he had an open kick across the lane, uh, but we mentioned earlier he was diving on the floor. He is a gamer, knows how to finish, Jay. Look at and the run out. Fisher ahead to King running the floor, and he scored even with the play well defended by Reginald Delt. How about the reaction going to the right hand? Reynolds, Corey Fisher, they moved it quickly into the corner. And Corey Stokes with a three. See the composure now. That's essential for Villanova. Watch this one though, Jay. What a great individual oh. move. The nice little right to left crossover. A little oh. lingerie on the deck with that kid. Villanova hasn't been this close since it was 12 to 8 early on. One thing about Villanova's defense thus far, they've stayed down in a stance much better in this second half. And the comeback continues. The little fadeaway by Scotty Reynolds. And in a weekend in which a lot of leads in the Big East have evaporated, Louisville has lost almost all of a 17 point advantage tonight. Villanova within two. Sosa missed a three. Carrot, great hustle, then lost it on a deflection to Stokes. Redding stripped by Smith, wound up with Waynes. Looked like a goal 10 wasn't called by Samuels. It was close, and Yaru dropped it in. Staying with it. Villanova, the preseason pick to win in the coaches' poll. Louisville was picked fourth. So now a three ball would give Villanova the lead. Reynolds going for it and has it. And King's the one that kept it alive to get that open opportunity. He gets his hands on a lot of junk. King sends it inside. Pena back to King and he's fouled. Wow, what a smart cut. And how about this? Great read, huh, Jay? The give and go. It still works, doesn't it? It sure does. The hard basket cut off the post. Lead the defense leading to offense here in the second half for the Wildcats. They have certainly been more active, shooting the gap, active hands. We said early in the second half that Villanova was doing a much better job of staying down in a stance. They weren't going for fakes, and they have really taken the fight to Louisville in this second half because they have come back with some haymakers in this second half. The quick trap, then another trap at half court, and you cannot throw that ball up for grabs. Tough pass, but it got in the King. Wants to attack the press and does, oh. and Pena the finish. He plays with confidence. Great feel for the game. Jay, for Scotty Reynolds. Look where he pulls this up, though, Jay. You know, you're right. They go underneath on a kid like this, but he just loves to stick it. That's big time. Mm. That is big time on the road. Reynolds gives Villanova a six point lead. Ooh. Does he step up? Reynolds for three. Oh. Oh. Early. Onions. Oh, my goodness. This kid likes the spotlight and delivers. 